It's day two of Northumbrian Waters Innovation Festival. Yes, the weather may have turned here, but it hasn't stopped the flow of bright ideas. Today is all about the ideas and the festival is going to be just pinging with ideas from everywhere and they're going to be coming up with lots of things that maybe they haven't thought about before. The fun and laughter that they're having will dislodge those ideas that maybe normally sit in their heads and don't come out. The theme for this year's festival as we discussed yesterday was citizens and it was inspired by a brilliant book that I read. We have the author of the book here to talk to us about it today. So please join me in welcoming up to the stage, John Alexander. I'm loving it. I think it's so exciting, the possibility. You don't know what's going to come out, but the very fact that you're bringing all these different people together from all these different backgrounds, that is the magic stuff, right? That is where you're going to get the truth that all of us are smarter than any of us from. And the ideas that are going to come out of this, I think, could, could be transformative. And my God, we need them. So today we've been setting the scene of a challenge, uh, understanding the, the different people we've got in the room and then starting to brainstorm some key factors. We're looking at um, the sprint about um, smart optimised sewers. So this morning has been about, a lot about um, educating people about what an um, overflow does, how it operates, and just bringing the whole tent up to a common understanding. We're a partnership between the two universities, Edinburgh and Harriet Watt universities, and the reason we exist is to enable more people to use more robots more of the time. And the focus here is to explore the utilities and the water industry and see how our expertise can uh, benefit the industry. We're focusing on nature-based solutions. How can we bring different partners together to think about how we collaborate on improving the environment? This morning we're really trying to understand the problem, so we're sharing kind of how Northumbrian Water deals with leakage and district metered areas in our network. We have lots of different activities today. We believe that um, health and wellbeing should overspill into everything you're doing. It's got stuff for your mind, so some chill out space, great music, entertainment, having fun. <laughs> We're going around, people are working hard solving problems, so we'd like to give them a bit of light relief and then take credit for when they solve those problems. Yeah, 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 and commission. We've got a room full of brilliant brains here, so it's just trying to extract as much information and knowledge as we can. We've made some incredible connections over the last day and a bit. Um, different industries, uh, different parts of the water industry, and lots of different suppliers as well. So yeah, we're really uh, connecting, and it's bringing all the brains together. Day two has been amazing. So many ideas. I literally cannot believe the creativity of the crowd that we have here today. So we now have so many ideas that they are going to have a tough job tomorrow to really whittle down those ideas and hone in on the really killer ideas that are going to make a big difference.